Marlon, you have just lived the dream of every single person on this island. How does it feel? Uh, f- you know what, Max? It's, I don't mean you have spoke, both being Pompey fans, it's, it's the reason I came back. It's the reason the lads come to this football club, but it lived up to more than that ex- the expectation that I thought. It was... Yeah, I've been on that pitch as, as a young lad, um, but to be, uh, to be on it as a captain of the club that I've supported my whole career... A club that I came through at the age of eight years old. Um, honestly, it's one I look. It, it's legacy stuff, right? So that's like when I look back at my career, this would be the proudest moment of my whole career, and it's it's a career that's spanned for what 15 years now, 16 years. So yeah, unbelievable. Seeing people on the pitch that you know I grew up with, it's uh, it, it just just to give it to those fans is. Uh, I, yeah, I don't really know what to say, mate, to be honest. Neither do I. Yeah. But I'm going to say two things to you. Champions of League One, yeah. promoted to the Championship, but also you have just etched your name into the history of Portsmouth Football Club forever. That's more than anything, you know what I mean? The personal accolades, everything we talk about is... I said to this group before, like, we've got a moment. You, 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 Someone will be a hero tonight. We've got an opportunity to etch ourselves in, in history and... The thing about this football club, they don't forget you. Um, so I think for us now, we deserve to enjoy it. The fans deserve to enjoy it. You boys behind the camera deserve to enjoy it because I spoke about all season. We're all a big family here and we try to create something this year. And it's the team behind the team and everyone really chucking in and and kind of um, using using their own worth to help us achieve something this year. So I'm, I'm just pleased for everyone associated with this football club because it's a stepping stone to get us back to where we belong. There's too many years, too many times down the years we've struggled and um, to, to be back in the championship and, and, you know, fighting with some of the big boys is is unbelievable. And, it, and everyone in this city deserves it. And I just want to say thank you to, to Rich, the gaffer and the Eisners for, for backing us this year and, and giving us the platform to go out and achieve it. One thing about this football club is they'll never forget you. Another thing about this football club is they'll never do it the easy way. No, we didn't. Yeah, that's, that's but who cares? Popular. Who cares? I mean, I think that game typifies us as a group. Generally, like, we weren't at our best at all. Um, what's that, 17 games unbeaten now? We found a way. We find a way. And that's that's something, like I said, we'll keep going on about. And I don't want to bore people, but that's something we created. Another late, late goal, two late goals for, for determination. Not a lot of quality tonight or skill, but that heart and desire and something that we've done all season and I think that's why the fans can relate to us a little bit more and we, we wanted to give us give them a product on the pitch for them to be proud of and um, I think you've seen tonight that they're, they're proud of us and I'm proud of them being one of them um, you know I'm going to soak up I'm going watch, to watch it all back in, in a few weeks when I'm on holiday and um, really uh, really take it all in then